Hey guys, it's the Lazy Stone, and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be talking about three voice actors that sadly passed away from 2017, 2022, and rec most recently. And we'll get to that voice actor as soon as possible. But now, let's talk about regular show from Cartoon Network. There was an episode called Fuzzy Dice where the gang tried to grab a bunch of fuzzy dice for Pops. Because for some reason he's been looking at them for quite some time and he always wanted them. And they were the highest bidding price prize to get. So anyways, uh, the gang tries to attempt to get the dice and once they do they get encountered by these creepy animatronics called the Capicola Gang. Capicola Gang, my bad. And these creepy animatronics, the brown bear, the one holding the dice. So yeah, the Capicola gang is ruled by Dominic. Now, the Fuzzy Dice episode is uh, basically a plot that happens to be with these animatronics that are somewhat uh, like Five Nights at Freddy's, but isn't. I don't know. But yeah, I guess this was supposed to be a parody of that or Chuck E. Cheese's for all the Chuck E. Cheese fans out there. So Dominic... Uh, he's basically the guy who leads the group into a heist that were stealing a bunch of fucking diamonds and putting it in a fuzzy dice and they were supposed to lay low for like, a, well, I guess 20 years, I guess, and they were waiting until midnight where the gang comes into the game zone, fun fun zone or whatever the fuck it's called, uh, where they got, uh, they got exposed out into the open and basically the, the whole gang got shot down by the police. Yeah, so F12 on that one. But anyways, let me focus on Dominic. Dominic is voiced by John Sigan. John Sigan is a New York voice actor. Uh, he was in Metal Gear Solid 2, Liberty, uh, Liberty, Sons of Liberty, my bad, we got Liberty City mixed up, GTA, uh, Leo the Lion, and Bob. I, I, I don't know what the fuck that show is about, but he, he was there, and uh, I, yeah, anyway. Yeah, so John Sigan died in May 13th, 2017. Uh, I just wanted to put that out there because this one was pretty interesting because he's known as the lesser known uh, voice actors in the animation industry, but yeah, recipe. Alright, at number two we have Tony from uh, The Sopranos. So uh, Tony S, uh, he basically voiced, well I don't know how to not sound sus while saying this, but he voiced um, Big Daddy from Fairly Odd Parents. Now, Big Daddy is Wanda's father, and Cosmo's father-in-law. He doesn't approve of Cosmo, but anyways, yeah, I mean, who at, in, in the series, who would? He's basically a fucking idiot. So anyways, yeah, uh, Tony, yeah, he unfortunately passed away in July 8th, 2022, and it was pretty recent. It was during the summer, and if anything, Polly Walnuts, he was, that was his character, the character from the popular drama series, The Sopranos. From Tony Sopranos, from The Sopranos. Ugh, why did I say Tony Soprano? From The Sopranos. And yeah, I mean, it was a really popular series. He was a great actor. I wouldn't be surprised that Nickelodeon hired him to do this certain character that I had to, for some reason, say his name as well. Um, yeah, I'm gonna I'm just drop that. So anyways, yeah, rest in peace, Tony. You will be missed. And uh, you know I have to leave the best for last. The guy who basically started off our childhood from the very first moment Batman ever got in an animated series. We're talking about the one and only, the legendary Kevin Conroy. Now, Kevin Conroy has been known for voice acting a lot of characters that are in their middle ages. I wouldn't be surprised if he ended up voicing Uncle Max at some point from Ben 10 Alien Force. The voice is just too iconic and too similar. But anyways, yes, he has been voicing Batman in almost every fucking series. Kevin Conroy is known as that guy. He voiced almost every version of Batman out there in the animation version. If you needed a person to sound like Batman in your Warner Bros movie, film, or whatever you get to pick up, and if it's animated, he'll be there first. He will be there big first. But anyways, yeah, this guy, best voice actor of all time basically started our childhood if there's anybody who was able to voice batman it's kevin conroy and if you even noticed um he also voiced batman in the harley quinn show which is the most recent series that had to deal with batman so far and yeah again this guy he is a legend he will never be missed and for god god's sakes godspeed godspeed and yeah, that's about it. Uh, I mean, Kevin Conroy died in uh, November 
11th, 2022. So yeah, it's right after my mom's birthday. So hopefully there will be something to uh, pay tribute to after my mother's birthday. And that is to commemorate uh, uh, <clears throat> Kevin Conroy. Rest in peace. Yeah, so I know I've missed out on a few other voice actors that sadly passed away, but hey, this is the best I can do so far. Um, I wanted to start off with the one that was lesser known, and I wanted to continue on with somebody who did voice act a certain cartoon character, and then after that, the legend himself. So that's about it. Uh, this is Lazy Stone. Uh, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys later.